Make one of my favorite meals with me, a sausage and tasso gravy. We can eat that over rice. Start off with some cooking oil in your pot. So first you wanna get your favorite smoked sausage and mine is right here. I got eight links of my favorite smoked sausage cut up. It's a beef and pork mixed hot. And it's from a local store in my hometown called Rods. And in here, if you can see these little pieces, I also have some chicken tasso in there. Some smoked chicken tasso that I'ma brown as well. So get that in your pot and start a good browning on that. Get some of that brown. This is another smoked tassel, but this is beef. I'm gonna add that a little ways towards the end. Now I'm gonna be adding in that beef tassel. That's some smoked beef tassel. All right, it's time to drop those onions in. Let me show y'all in the pot. I'm almost to the point where I'm gonna start adding me some water. I got me some browning going on. That little green meat is sticking in the pot. Look at that. That's all good stuff. That's what I'm gonna add in. That's gonna give me a little bit of browning. I don't have a lot. Sausage ain't like no beef. It ain't like when I'm brown and beef, but look what we got going on right there. Tell y'all, this is going to be a reddish brown gravy. Really not brown, but a lot red. I'm going to be using a can of tomato sauce for now. One for now. And this ain't no bougie brand. You can use whatever brand you want. And there, there we go. The green at the bottom is sizzling up. About to put some water in it. I'm going to go ahead and add number two can of that tomato sauce. You got to be like the old people. Save everything. Put that water in there and get the rest of that tomato sauce out. I'm going to be adding in some water. Yes, I use water. And the water does come from my kitchen sink, but that's okay. It's not going to hurt you, y'all. People freak out when they, when they see me use water when I cook. That's how I grew up. We use water. We don't always have to use a broth. But yes, I know I can use that too. I'm going to be using my Cajun Walt seasoning. A little bit of my Creole Zotico seasoning. I won't be using the spicy because the sausage is already hot. I don't even need to add salt. With all that tomato sauce, the salt's gonna be there. Let me show y'all something that's about to freak out everybody. I gotta taste my gravy and make sure I don't need no more seasoning. Mm hmm And yes, this is my cooking spoon and I don't care. No, I don't have nobody coming over for supper, but yes, I'm bringing this to my brother and I still don't care. That's just how we do it. If you ain't never went to eat at a Cajun's house, I guarantee you, when you do go, that's gonna happen. That's gonna happen. And there's that sausage and tasso tomato gravy. Ooh, y'all know what time it is. Here you go. It's time to manger if I didn't tell y'all yet. But y'all already know that. Good old sausage and tasso tomato gravy. Mm, mm, mm. Check that out. Some homemade corn mushroom from the freezer, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Tell you what, I'm about to swallow down right here. So I say, buku bonsha.